Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of the Toy Box. I'm Mr. Paku Paku, and today I want to show you all the pickups I've got since our last video. Um, I know it's, I said it's going to be a while since I do grab a few things, because a lot of the um, big box stores here don't have too much uh, inventory. But I did find a couple of interesting things since our last video. And I'll start off with this Crash Bandicoot Funko Pop. It's a Crash Bandicoot with scuba gear. I know this has been out um, for a while, but um, I didn't really get my hands on these when these first came out. But I was lucky to find a second hand. box was in pretty good condition, so I grabbed it. It was only like maybe six bucks, but pretty cool. I put in a pop box protector right away. Um, next is an older X-Men toy from the Toy Biz line. First I have here is the Phoenix um, action figure, Jean Grey. Um, still has the X-Men uh, card and stuff. I used to have like the almost the whole collection here. Here's what the back looks like. Uh, I used to have all everyone in this line and this line. I even had this Sentinel when I was a kid. It was it was maybe about like a foot big. Oops. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, let me fix that. Okay. Sorry about that. Okay. So yeah, that was the that was the Sentinel. It's about a foot. I never found the Blackbird, and I'm pretty sure if I found that today, it'd be out of reach as far as price goes. And next toy is this same thing, X Men Toy Biz. Um, it's Nightcrawler, and I guess people are wanting these uh, toys again because. They've made a re-release, the 80th anniversary, or 80 years of Marvel or whatever. And, you know, ever since it's been showing on Disney+, Plus, um, a lot of people are getting back into the nostalgia things, so... There's that. And my next toy, I am really excited to show. It is this Shredder Turtles in Time. It's like a Wave 2. I missed out on Wave 1, but they didn't really have anyone that uh, interested me, except for the Ninja Turtles. But Shredder was my favorite character in um, this game. I'm not sure if it became a TV show, because it does say Nickelodeon up here. Yeah. So, I'm not sure if they made it into a TV show. But, I mean, the color schemes and whatever, it's very, like, Super Nintendo-like, so um, I'm just gonna go with it. Let's put that in there, and that's pretty much the toy pickups I got. I did get a few uh, mystery bags, um, so we'll start off with. Uh, let me move this over a little bit. We'll start off with this gray one. I didn't open it yet. Um, you know, it's the Mario. It's a Mario Kart blind capsule. I just removed the plastic and kind of pre-opened it, so uh, you know, I don't spend five minutes just trying to like open it. I didn't see what's inside yet, so we'll see whose character is in here. Okay, we don't need capsule or instructions. It looks like. Let me get my scissors. And it's Princess Peach. Pretty cool. Okay, and the next one I got was this Batman black and white mystery bag. 
you know, every figure in here it will be a Batman, so it just depends what pose you get, I suppose. But let's see who we end up with, or which Batman we end up with. Wow. Okay. It's a pretty cool figure. Pretty big. I'd say it's about an inch and a half, maybe two. Well, that's pretty cool. It's a pretty cool display piece. Um, not bad. I got it for about two bucks. I got it from a secondhand store, uh, so I'm not sure how much, you know, the the package really retails for. But for two bucks, it's not a bad uh, display piece. Now for the last things that I got, um, I don't know if you remember my last video or the video before that. I got these X Men toys called Domes from the. Um, from the Lion Domes, or I think that's how you uh, pronounce it. But the reason why I couldn't find more of those is because they changed the packaging. It used to be in a little, ba a little bag. Now they moved on to this box. So I'm not sure if it's smaller. It looks smaller, but um, I don't know. The bag used to be a lot taller. Um, but it looks like they made a new uh, new poses for people but that's what it looks like I got two of these that we'll be opening so let's see who we get in the first box and these were about five dollars uh, each so the only thing that really changed was uh, the packaging which I'm grateful for see and even like it's in a black bag as it comes out so we're going to need our scissors to cut and again I'm hoping to get Wolverine or Magneto I think the last two I got were um, Professor X and Cyclops so we got here Beast not bad I would prefer the I would prefer Wolverine but I'll take these. All right, so let's see who we get in this box. Alrighty, there's the black box, the black, uh, black bag. And we get another beast. Would you look at that? Two beasts. This is why I have the love-hate relationship with a... Uh... Oh wait, is this one? I thought for a second they were both different, but... Yep, we ended up with two beasts. This is why we kind of love, hate it. I mean, there's a good, there was probably a good chance we'd get, you know, a different character in each, but I guess that's the name of the game. But all right, thank you for watching. If you like uh, more content like, like this, please like and subscribe. Don't forget to leave a comment. You know, I'll try to respond. I like to talk to, uh, you know, people who comment on my page. Um... Alright, so see you guys next time. Thank you. Peace out.